10 years after we first met Lightning McQueen, he's now seeing a new, faster generation of racers in his rear view mirror. Sound familiar? Buckle up for a new superstar in the fast lane. Get ready for what's coming. and Storm is part of the next generation of high-tech racers. A rookie sensation. Jackson Storm. Jackson Storm. Jackson Storm's in a class of his own. Hey, champ. You had a good run. You have no idea what a pleasure it is for me to finally beat you. Did you say meet or beat? I think you heard me. Enjoy your retirement. <laughs> You're not quite the car you used to be. No, <laughs> and he's got to kind of face, uh, you know, what we all have to sort of face that, uh, you know, you can't always be at the top. And for Lightning McQueen, um, it's kind of like a nice, you know, arc or the way it comes full circle in the first one with Paul Newman being kind of a mentor to my character. And then in this one, when Lightning McQueen has these challenges that he's able to sort of end up, um, you know, kind of being a mentor to someone else. You'll never be the racer you once were. You can't turn back the clock, kid. But you can wind it up again. The racing world is changing. Treadmills, wind tunnels, virtual reality. Still working on that. And interactive race simulation. Whoa, 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 whoa! Danger, ah! you have jumped a barrier. Oh! You are on fire. Ah! You are going the wrong way. Shut up! Shut up! You have crashed. We got some work to do. You're the brain. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of the things I love about Natalie Certain, I mean, I really we talk a lot about bringing girls into science and technology mm -hmm. and math, and so I do love that the statistician is a girl car. Um, but I also love that she um, is like a, a bossy pants know-it-all who's a little bit arrogant, and she's wrong in the end. And I think this film kind of humbles her because she learns that we can't always be seduced by the numbers and by kind of going toward what's shiny and new. We have to also value our members of society that have more experience and wisdom. I love the Cruz character in this in this movie because we don't really focus on the fact that she's female. We actually focus on the fact that she's very good at her job and while she's good at it, she still has doubts. And I think it's a very relatable human story which is ironic because she's a car. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, there's so many there are many many different subject matters here. I mean, the, Absolutely. the messages aging, yes. um, respect, yes. like you said, female power. But I, I felt like really your car, your car which is mm -hmm. just, look, she's just right there. Isn't she adorable? You look just like her. <laughs> um, but your, she was, she was experienced. She kind of, I mean, she just wasn't able to get to the next level. Well, you know, sometimes I, I you know, this is true with so many people. Even though you're great at something that you do, she's a motivator but we forget that motivators need to be motivated. And sometimes, even if you're great at what you do, sometimes you need somebody to tell you, hey, you're very good at what you do. Visualize beating this guy. Go! The beach ate me. Every week, veteran racers retire to make room for these younger, faster racers. Have you given any thoughts to retirement? Please, over here. Okay. No questions. Paparazzi. You'll never be as fast as Storm, but you can be smarter. Good luck out there. You're gonna need it. I decide when I'm done. You are not winning this. I'm coming for you, Storm. Flag down the best race cars in the world with Cars 3 and your real-time theater.